Hey, it's Marty from martyangland.com and in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can set up a shopping cart using Leadcart. All right, welcome back. And uh, for those of you who don't know what Leadcart is, or you've come across Leadcart and you want more information about it, well, I do have a full Leadcart review video, which you can find in the description in the link found below. You can also find a full blown blog and video demonstration with the lifetime offer uh, for Leadcart found on my website. Uh, and again, you'll be able to find this in the description below. So why would you want to create an online shopping cart? Well, loads of reasons. Number one, with an online shopping cart, you can literally take a URL and send it to anyone uh, and they will be able to check out online. And you will also be able to automate the whole process in terms of the follow-up and the delivery of the product itself if it's a digital product. So there's a million and one reasons why you would want to set up a shopping cart and the great thing about Leadcart is it takes like no time at all and I'm going to show you how to do it right now. We're going to head over to product pages and we're going to create a new product. Now one of the products that I'm wanting to sell is a ebook guide, a step-by-step ebook -step e guide um, all about how you can get your videos to number one on Google and YouTube in virtually 10 minutes. In fact, I actually call this system the 10 minute ranking system. I know, how original. So one of the first things that I want to do is drag in an image just like that and I'm going to put in an image of the product so people know what it is they're buying. Okay, now that's been done. The next thing I want to do is create one of those progress bars so people know whether or not where they're up to in the process and it also helps complete stuff. So I'm just going to select that and change the theme to this color um, and I'm also going to put do um, almost complete. Okay, just like that. So and now I want to make this at, let's just call it 73%. Okay, so now we've got a progress bar. We've got this. What else do we want to put in? Some basic text to this display. So I'm going to drag this in like that. And I'm going to paste in the little title, which is my step-by-step -step guide. Do we want to make it a bit bigger, a little bit bigger? Okay, so we'll just leave it like that. And I'm going to change... Um, I'm going to make it bold and also change the color just like so. Okay, my step-by-step -step guide on how I upload videos, rank them and earn small payments every day in mass. And this is completely true. It's an absolute guide. If you want to purchase this, uh, go ahead and click the link in the description because, you know, it is actually a guide that I'm selling at the moment. Okay, so that's right there like so. Next, you know, you want to tell people, well, what is it that they're actually going to be getting? So we can do this in a few ways so we can add a... A feature here so first feature second feature third feature so the first thing that they're going to learn is um, the I Google and YouTube okay and you can add more features if you wanted to you can change the points color to whatever you want like so and um, you can add more custom bullets or on off it's completely up to you uh, just like so I'm going to leave it like that, okay? I don't really like it like that, so I'm just gonna delete it. Next, I want to, there's not really much more I want to do to this page. Perhaps I wanna change the button. So I'm just gonna click on the page like so, and I can change the product width to full, but I'm not keen like that. So screen background color. Uh, let's go ahead and change it to that color. Let's go to product background, change it to orange. Nope, don't like it. I'm actually gonna just change it back to white, okay? Then the theme color, let's make that orange. Okay, so that looks good. And there we go, complete order and the fields are all done. Now, I don't really like these icons at the top, so I'm just gonna hide them like so. Okay, so that's now gone. And yeah, I'm actually happy with that, okay? So next thing, I wanna change this form slightly. So I wanna change the pricing on it, click the gear icon, go over here, and I'm gonna sell this for £2.97. Um, I'll add more pricing options so I can actually add, you know, um, test one if I wanted to and 7.97, whatever, and add it like that. And you can see there's a new pricing option there, but I'm not really going to add anything else there. Uh, I could add a bump offer if I really wanted to, and the bump offer is right here, you know, um, but again, I don't really want to. I just want to keep this really simple. 
Okay, so that's like that. People can pay by credit card or PayPal. And boom, that's actually done. I'm just going to title this uh, big. Okay. So there we go. We've got the checkout page. Let's go ahead and press save. Okay, so that's now been done. So next, I want to create a funnel. So I'm just going to head over to funnels, new funnel, uh, checkout funnels, uh, small payments. Okay, or small payments, big profits. And then I'm going to call it thank you. Okay. So go ahead and click create and now go to the checkout page. I'm going to connect the checkout page with the product page that we just created. And then I'm going to go drag a thank you page just here. And I'm going to select, I've not created a thank you page. So I'm just going to get new thank you. And I'm going to add in um, a figure and I'm just going to, should we swap the sides? I think I might swap the sides. So if I click on the gear icon, go here, pick this, re-upload the ebook, just say thank you. Okay, then please below to purchase this guide. Okay, then I'm going to add a button. Okay, and uh, select this, just go to buttons, click here, styles. I want to make it justified so it's nice and big. Um, do I want a border? I think I'm going to make the top left, uh, I'm going to turn off top left, turn off top right, um, bottom left, bottom right. You know what? We'll just make it all funky like that. Keep solid. Um, there we go. Okay. That's a hideous button, but whatever. Okay. And then we're going to do external link and a external link right there. Okay. So that's my button done. And then we're going to go ahead and call this um, thank you page page and we're just going to do FBBP. Okay. Save. And it looks, how does it look on mobile? Okay. That looks fine because it's only a download page. We're going to go back and now we're going to connect these together. Okay, so now we just need to connect this to here. So that's now been connected. We're going to go ahead and press save. We're then going to share this funnel, click copy, and we're going to just open it up in a new browser. So now you can see the browser's open. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to fill out my information here, do the checkout and show you what that looks like. Okay, so now that has been purchased and you can see it's automatically sent them to the download page, okay? And then if they click this button, they will be able to download it. I do hope you enjoyed this lead cart tutorial. I only wanted to make it really simple and quick just to show you that it is actually possible to build out a quick shopping cart online really simple and fast. There doesn't need to be hugely complicated or fancy design sort of stuff. You just need something simple and something that works and something that you can just send to people and something that will just automate the process for you. And that's exactly what Leadcart does. Also, uh, in case you didn't know, they have a lifetime uh, deal on at the moment, which is basically you pay a small fee and you will have lifetime access to all of it and all the features. Um, I'm not sure how long they're keeping it on the market for, but you'll find all the information about their monthly pricing if you don't go with the lifetime offer. The actual price for the one-time offer is $59. Um, and the monthly, yearly, and all of that information can be found there. You'll also find my conclusion. And if you want a full-blown review of Leadcart, you'll be able to find that. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.